Good morning, everybody. This is Kathy, and welcome to Punched Out Thursday to Die For. Now, this week, I am recreating a layout that I did last month with the uh, showcase of all the pretty Cosette collection. I used uh, the three piece of paper, which is three inches by nine and a half. And then instead of using hearts, I decided to use stars on this one. Something different. And then I chose a bright, colorful um, paper from, I think it's Color Wash, Color something from uh, Heidi Swap. Now I used a grid background. Only because it went with the collection and I was, I'm waiting for some new stuff to come in. And, um, and that way I can maybe get my mojo back. It, it has been, oh, so stressful in this house. And I just haven't, I haven't really scrapbooked since Becky left and, um, yeah, it's just, uh, it's getting really hard, but I could do this, um, anyway, um, yeah, I love, I went through my, uh, alpha words and found this package, I think it's from American Crafts or Crate, I'm pretty sure it's American Crafts whole bunch of bright pink titles so sorry about my head and I'm sorry my light burned out on my um, over my table so it's going to be dark until I can get me another little light plus my lights in my room are dimming too and that's one of the reasons why I haven't had a video because it's been so dark and it's the sun is it shine I have a tree outside both windows and it kind of shades the sun. What was I thinking when we moved in, huh? <laughs> Planting them trees. Anyway, um I am going to be um layering up these stars. Now, I'm using the Close to My Heart Star Shaker window and, or stars, so I didn't make a shaker, but I thought I would use the big outline here and then pop dot the next size that comes out of there, but in different paper, and pop that up to start my cluster I didn't bring in, I brought in two, three brads like I did my other page, but I didn't bring any enamel dots. Um, it was nice to use up some of these brads that are on my desk. So my husband is refusing to eat. And he gets downright mean about it. Um, he's really starting to get mean. But um, last night I was fixing pork chops. And I like to fix him one meal. And then he, well, we all eat leftovers. So um, he said, um, don't be fixing me, any. I mean, oh, he was pissed. I said, of course not. You're go not going to eat my cooking. Well, Kathy shouldn't have said that because it really pissed him off. He was screaming in my face and wanted to know what was going on. He's getting really confused. And, yeah, I, I guess I should have bit my tongue, but... It's really hard when you have stuff like that flying out of someone you love's mouth. And you, you know, sometimes you have, have enough, you know. I'm sitting here enjoying my coffee, listening to the birds. 
I think this layout's really going to be pretty. Uh, it turned out really pretty. I love the colors. Love that I brought in that yellow gold strip. And that, you know, goes with both other papers. So, really cute. I must maybe see about doing stretch the sketch. Now, I will try and post... Um, I was going to post this last week. I just haven't had time, but I have a layout share for April. Um, this is Wednesday that I'm finally getting around to doing my voiceover. But uh, I'll try and post that Wednesday night. I was going to post it earlier, but didn't get it done in time. I do off camera go back and glue these letters down and I move it over just a hair bit because this kind of um, was it it's not really centered that well so um, off camera I went ahead and fixed that this is where I put my brands in and you could do this layout um, I have a Pinterest board, and I save sketches on there, and that's where I found the sketch to do last month. And I loved it so much that I wanted to recreate it. And you can use anything. You can use circles, um, tags. You know, I, I did hearts. I didn't really embellish that much because of all the stars and um, I didn't put any phrases on there. I did add fun at the bottom of the page, but other than that, it's a really simple layout that you can use your punches and your dies. Now, don't forget to go check out my Scrappy Friends and um, see what they are doing. Ronnie, Sue, Laura, and Sonia. See what they are creating this month. And don't forget to get out your punches and your dies. Now I'm using up some of the scraps to outline my photos. I need to take a day and go through all my photos and... Um, maybe I'll do a, a chat, sit down and chat why I am sorting. I will see if I can fit that in. Now, February, or February, nope, June, I will be going to a scrapbooking retreat with Becky and um, a bunch of girls, and, um, so I will be having videos for June, hopefully, <laughs> if I, if I don't visit the whole time, <laughs> you know, I don't, I like to visit with people because I'm kind of stuck in the house. So yes, I talk a lot. I talk to you guys a lot. I feel better after I, you know, visit with you guys. This is where I pulled in the sticker sheet and I got up there. I have a stack of drawers behind my chair and I have scraps of white daisy cardstock. I am going to stick that on there and fussy cut the fun out just so you can see it a lot better. I like putting the clear stickers on white daisy or, you know, white cardstock. And this is smooth, so... Um, it, you know, goes on really nice. Sorry I left all that in. I have four halfway made Mini Kit Monday kits, and I just haven't had time to finish them. And, um, so yeah, I have all those. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Um, because I made them with the, you know the challenge but yeah that's why I haven't had anything on there 
These are stars from the sticker sheet, and boy, they are hard to remove off of here. So I just kind of pulled this whole sheet out so I can lift them up. So these are kind of going as my enamel dots. I want to keep bringing the star theme in here. And decide where I want that. Just look and see if there's anything else. I'm um, stirring up my Jen Hatfield um, gloss or glitter spray. <clears throat> I'm going to put lots and lots of splatters. <clears throat> going to add a brad down here by the stars. All right, lots and lots of splatter. It look, I like the gold look, and it, I like this gloss spray. All right, here are some close-ups. Don't forget to check out the other girls, and I'll see you next month. Bye-bye.